All right, uh, good afternoon one and all and uh, welcome to the video. My name is Samil Shah. In this video, I want to share an architecture with you on AWS, which can basically uh, convert customer call data. Once the customer call has been ended, it can it can convert that into a, into a text for Elasticsearch for analyzing purposes. So let's see the architecture and let's talk a little bit about that, okay? So first of all, what happens is basically, uh, according to my architecture, uh, the customer would, you know, call, call the, you know, you, you would place a call and once the call is done, that uh, uh, call file would be dumped on an S3. As soon as it's dumped on an S3, we would fire up an event to an SNS saying that, uh, that um, you know, we would publish an event. As soon as that event is published, uh, that uh, pay, payload would be put on, on an SQS queue. After an SQS queue is done, what we could do is we, then uh, we, we can fire up a Lambda. The Lambda would basically simply place the request on a Redis queue so the workers can come and take the task, okay? So we can return a task ID to the customers. Now, what happens is basically uh, on the Docker containers, we have the salary workers, which are which is gonna pull, which is gonna pull the Redis queue. Once we get the key or the payload from the Redis, what we do is basically we call deep speech model as you can see, uh, I would dump the code in the description. It's uh, I, I took it from some GitHub uh, profile, but uh, yeah, this is the code. Okay, so I'm going to leave everything here in the description section. So all you got to do is basically the, the salary task worker is, is it's gonna, you got to write this code. So what it's going to do is kind of the worker, it's going to go to the S3, grab the file, call the model. Uh, that is this file right here. The model is going to convert that into a text file. Once you have a text file, what you could do is dump that raw text into an S3. As soon as it's dumped on an S3, we again, uh, you know, put we, we basically put that, we fire up on an SQS, we'll, we'll put that data, you know, put that event on, on an SQS queue, then it fires up a Lambda, Lambda would call Spacey, Spacey, it would do sentiment analysis, it would grab the raw text, convert into a JSON payload and put on the Elasticsearch. That way you could analyze the call of the customer on Elasticsearch through Kibana. So it can also tell the sentiment, how, how positive or negative the call was. It can uh, give you a lot of more details. You know, you can, you can see the conversation, what, what was replied. You could do entity recognition. You could grab the name from that text using Spacey and a lot more, right? So you see the potential of this architecture, right? Hope you, uh, yeah, just wanted to share this uh, with you. Hope you did enjoy this small architecture. If you did enjoy, let me know in the comments. And I do know that you could uh, absolutely use uh, AWS Transcribe. Uh, the reason for this architecture is basically I didn't want it to use a transcribe. I wanted to use some sort of my own architecture. That's why. But hey, if you use transcribe, then everything is, uh, you know would strip off because transcribe would do all the audio to you know all, all of that stuff. Then we could dump it on an S3 again. So all of that. So but yeah, this is the initial. Uh, then we could use um, uh, AWS Comprehend to do sentiment too on the text. But hey, as I said, if you don't want to use uh, AWS machine learning model, you could use your custom models. You have to create a microservice, host on Docker and you know do the job hope you did enjoy if so do give a like if you have any more questions list your questions in the comments and as usual thank you for uh, love and support see you guys in the next upcoming videos